So I had an epiphany one night where I went, oh my God, I know what I want to do. I want to actually give back and work for charity. So this is where Tea House was born. So we're here today to launch at Tea House brand and product to the Sydney media. We actually deal with three charities. We create beautiful and bespoke homewares range and all our profits go to these three charities. Each one of our products is about the charity. So whatever product we make, it makes sense to each one of them. So my first one was Eat Up Australia. They actually go to schools and they give sandwiches to children who are disadvantaged and hungry. One in five children go to school with food insecurities. We actually produced a lunchbox and a bento box and an apron because your child goes to school with a lunchbox, but there's a child that goes to school with no lunch and no lunchbox. My other one was the Lighthouse Foundation. Now, every time I mention that name, I get really teary. They obviously deal with long-term abuse, violence, and homeless children. And they do work a lot with fostering children out, and now they're part of also helping adoption. So that was a, a charity that obviously touched me very, a lot. We have got all products to do with house and home because they provide homes for homeless children. So we've got things like our platters, organisational products. Most of these children have never had anything brand new. They usually live off getting everything second hand. So they like to give them something new and fresh. It's about new beginnings. And my last one is one very close to my heart. The Robert Connor Dawes Foundation. They actually raise money for research, development and care for paediatric brain cancer, which is the number one killer in cancer for young adults. When you get brain cancer, you can lose your sense of smell. When you smell something, it actually activates the brain and gives you memories. So it might be a candle range that we have or the spray. That's how we actually come up with our products. I wanted to actually make a dialogue and a narrative and create an awareness. You'll buy an item knowing that you're helping a charity along the way. So my vase is my favourite. Why? Number one, I designed it. Number two, was bespokely made by Mark Douglas. It's actually hand blown. Mark Douglas is one of Australia's renowned glass blowers. He's won many awards. So we were lucky enough to ask him to help us out. And he's only, we've made a range of 50 only. They're signed and numbered. So one day they'll actually be worth quite a bit of money. By creating a platform that we have, what I'm doing is trying to change the narrative and the dialogue that is out there. So I'm creating awareness. I'm helping these charities not only through selling product and making money for them, I'm also helping them with networking, finding the right people that can help them. On top of that, I'm creating dialogue in the community. The whole idea also with our products, we're trying to be as eco-friendly and sustainable as possible. We'd like to be Australian made as possible. Also, the people that we deal with are small businesses, people, women, empowering women as well. We don't go to big companies, we want to support the small person as well. We would love your support and the way to do that is to get onto our website, teahouse.com.au. Be part of a positive change and make it your everyday event.